Hey, bitch, I could be a fantasy. I could tell you got big, deep energy. It ain't too many niggas that can handle me. I just got ready, took a shower, put some face on, and I'm about to head to church right now. I'm just getting my notebooks ready because um, I like to take notes in church. I'm like really into church and really into like strengthening my faith with God. I'm not like the perfect Christian, but I do my best, honestly. And going to church every Sunday. I actually prayed for this so I had that car accident and lost the car so I couldn't get back and forth I cannot find my notebook <sighs> my house I had that uh, accident and I couldn't go back and forth with the car so I got really like close in faith with God um, with no car um, once I got a car, and I prayed to go to this specific church, because I was drawn to this church. And then once I got the car, I have been going to church ever since. So I've been going to church for a straight month. Let's see, June, July, August. For a straight two months, every Sunday, haven't missed one. So, and I really don't do these, but I've been doing like a lot of overtime work this week and just a lot of, whew, I've been stressed this week. I even smoked weed this week and I stopped smoking weed, kind of, a little bit. <laughs> That's my day. I really don't do much to my face, but today I put on some foundation and yeah, I'm, I'm still sleepy. I'm still a little drained a little bit, but and I had thoughts like, should I go to church? I could just really watch it on my phone. But I love being in person. I love the in-person experience. It's a little more personal for me because I pray to get into that building. Like, I literally pray to be in that building to worship God. So, I would never try to miss... I would never miss a Sunday because I'm sleepy. I can always go back to sleep after. <laughs> but I have to get the kids today. Um, so, it's a, it's a jam-packed day. I... I'm exhausted I'm not gonna lie super exhausted but I got this I really do got this trying to run my businesses and just my brands and stuff and then being a mom and then yeah, having a nine to five is just not it's not what it is I need to let go of my nine to five but it's not the right time right now so anyways I'm like on a whole freaking tangent right now I'll see you guys in a little bit Where are we going? Huh? So where are we going? I don't do school. Tell them how you like school. Good. I love the school. Lunch. I will never ever pack lunch again. <laughs> you so lo you love the lunch, huh? That's so silly. I never tried school lunch before. Hey, it's a little boy. Hey. <laughs> I made a big call. Hey, I mean, I'm gonna go. <laughs> My day was good. No. How was your day? Huh? All I said today was good. What's up guys? So I'm in my closet right now because my mirror is right here and I'm about to do my hair. It's like this in like a little bun, but I'm so over my hair. Um, so I gotta do something to it. So I have some braiding hair that I had left over or whatever. And I'm gonna just try to make like two Dutch braids, but I thought I would do it with you guys. So I have my comb with me. I have this is the best thing ever, the black control, African black control. It works best with my hair. So I'm just going to attempt to do something. My hair is not that nappy, 
but it's nappy. Uh, if I'm like whispering, my kids are asleep. It's school night. Um, so I'm not trying to be too loud. But I've been up. Um, I finally made my intro, as you saw. Ooh, I really just haven't been taking YouTube seriously. Um, and if you look at my videos, I've been, ow, <laughs> I've been doing YouTube for quite a while. And I would just blame it on just inconsistent, um, inconsistency. Ooh. Uh, my hair's been in a bun for like a whole week, so it's like kind of nappy. I'm remodeling my closet. I mean, I can't do much because I'm in an apartment, obviously. Um, but if you guys don't know, I'm in a one-bedroom apartment with two kids, and we all share a closet. And so my closet is crazy. Like, y'all gonna see the video when I post it. I'm doing a remodeling series for my closet. Um, I've been getting ideals and whatever. Um, I've been getting ideals of like how to revamp this thing because I feel like I won't be good at like life and then being like a single mom taking care of the kids, you know, by myself. They live here full time, they don't live with their dad. They go over there every so often, so like they're with me. They're, they're, you know, I'm literally taking care of them, and I just, I'm overwhelmed. I've been getting like ideals off of like Pinterest of some things I like that might go good in here. So I'm excited to see what it ends up looking like and the end result. But I know like the process is gonna be super fun for me. I love like you know I have a cleaning business so I like to clean it's just my house like that's just messing me up and I think it's because I don't have my own space my kids don't have their own space so we're all just clustered in here and it's kind of just not giving anymore like and then like I've been like really slacking on myself like as far as a mom like keeping my hair done um just you know all that like I'm just I want a new make I'm like I'm I'm getting I'm doing a new a makeover I will be doing a makeover very soon you know I just want to be cute like so I'm just putting that black edge control and I do not expect this to be perfect I just want it to be decent I had this hour call with this woman you know she was having issues with you know her lawn or whatever and we were just talking and then I don't know how we got on the subject of just life and going for our goals but man she was she seemed like a real cool mentor but I just really appreciated that because this morning it was just crazy it's like God put her in my path I, I really don't believe in coincidence I feel like every conversation I have everything I have is supposed to be we were supposed to have that conversation it was supposed to happen and she was just you know kind of being a big mentor to me talking about you know I have great customer service, like, I can't really do anything. I was telling her about my cleaning business and me doing, um, me creating lashes. And by the way, hmm, so if you follow me on Instagram, you know, I was, like, pursuing the lash deal. But I just feel like that lash business is really good money. It really can be really good money. And I'm pretty sure you can find clients, but I just don't want to be in people's face so y'all know i'm anti-social i just don't want to be in people's face i don't i don't like like i don't know that's probably why i don't got no friends because i don't like being people's face <laughs> i really need that conversation i'm so hard on myself what does it look like y'all gonna see before me <laughs> um but now i'm finna do this other side hopefully this is gonna get done quick because i'm over it already <laughs> I don't like combing my hair, y'all. Alright, I'm finna get this last braid done. Okay, she is done. She is okay. Listen, this is my hair. And the only thing is I gotta cut this braid because I made it longer. I only use one, one of them. 
and then I added two here so that's why it's a little longer but it's okay I'm just gonna cut it and it's not gonna be my forever hair so I'm not tripping and I'm gonna put this bonnet on this bonnet I got from this is part of Keisha I think it's part of Keisha Coles no 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 my mom gave me this one but I do have a purple head thing to um, a bonnet um, and she gave me this because I had them dreads and them twists in. so I was going through my makeup and right now this is how much makeup I have it's all in this little box and I have none so and I have so I have a bunch of these like lipsticks and not lipsticks but eyeliner and lip liners that are like not sharpened and I don't know where my sharpener that comes with this eyeliner is so I don't have a sharpener and I need to get a sharpener for those so y'all I really don't have any makeup this just ran out I love this one I'm not gonna lie I love the elf um eyebrow liner I also have the NYX Tame and Frame I still have some of that on here in here I have a little bit like you can see I use and I use it with this um, angled brush to put it on so this is the Born This Way Too Face I actually like it I just ran out of my powder yeah I have like no makeup and this is from CoverGirl I believe or L'Oreal and then I use this sometimes to make little you know fake moles or whatever I need to spend more money on me I'm in Born as well and I, I get I forget that sometimes like I have to make sure i'm good and i am at the top of my game so i can be at the top of my game for my kids so thank you guys so much for watching i hope you guys liked my little hair tutorial <laughs> or watching me do my hair um got my little pjs on i'm gonna go to bed my little reindeer socks uh, i'm gonna go to bed y'all and hope you guys like this video